everybody, Stephanie here, and welcome to the video. Today, I'm just going to quickly show you what I got from the most recent Balance Athletica slash Vitality sale. So this package took a long time to get here, which is why this video is so late, but that's okay. I still wanted to do this little unboxing haul for you guys, so without further ado, Let's get into it. I don't think I've ever actually done a balance video before, which is strange because they have a lot of their stuff and I am not affiliated or sponsored by them and I am definitely not one of their athletes or anything like that. So sadly, I don't have any sort of support code or discount code or anything like that for you guys, but I do have a discount code for something else, which I will talk about a little bit later. So this time I only have a few things to show you. I actually wanted and I had way more, like way more in my cart, but the website was having like these really weird glitches when I was trying to check out. So I ended up losing a whole bunch of stuff and I only ended up with five items, which is probably a good thing since I'm trying to decrease my spending, but I was really upset at the time. So first up is the core bra and I have mine in the color Lava Rock and this one is in a medium and actually everything that I have today is in a medium so that just makes things a little bit easier and also as always my measurements are going to be in the description box down below so make sure you check that out. So I actually wanted this bra originally in this like purple tie-dye color because this is just so pretty. This is just a pair of shorts that I had previously purchased but the purple one got kicked out of my cart so I went back and grabbed this color because I just really wanted to try this specific bra because I've never had this one before and Taylor who is one of the owners of Balance calls this the boob job bra. So I wanted to see if it did anything for me and I guess it's not bad Like it does have removable padding, which I personally do like but I feel like it's just not really that Supportive I don't think it's supposed to be a high support sports bra anyway Like there isn't a whole lot of fabric here in the front But the straps are thicker and it is a racer back So it's like a light medium support sports bra I was almost thinking that maybe I might want a small one just to have that extra compression But then of course I risk like they're not being enough fabric here and it might be a little bit too snug so I don't know I'm always in between those two sizes I mean this one is still okay it's comfy and it's not digging in anywhere and it is definitely like pretty flattering I think that this is one of those styles that comes back every once in a while in new colors so maybe in the future I'll try a small and see how that goes I do overall still like the medium one but I wouldn't do anything like too high intensity in it I did wear it for a leg workout the other day though and I didn't really have any problems so overall I do think it's pretty cute next up I have the cloud rider shorts in the color Rio and these are actually the same shorts as these purple ones and I also wanted to get these shorts in this lava rock color but those those also got kicked out of my cart and I was so upset because these are one of my most favorite pairs of shorts they are just so soft so comfy and they don't dig into my thighs they are also pretty stretchy so I do think that I would fit into a small but I usually size up for my shorts for comfort and I do like these ones in a medium I have them in so many different colors and I love to wear them with an oversized t-shirt it's just so cute I personally like the length of these ones they're not too long and they definitely aren't too short and I'm not really much of a short shorts gal anyway so these ones are perfect for me they are also all differently dyed, so I kind of wish that I had more of like the dark green on the front because it's like all over the back here and it's not like proportioned properly, but I mean, like what are you gonna do about it? There's nothing you can really do. They're all different. Like here's my purple ones and I really like these ones because the color is kind of more evenly distributed, but oh well, <laughs> nothing I can do and I still really love green obviously, so these are still really good shorts in my book. Okay, now we're just gonna take a quick little break to talk about something super exciting. I have recently discovered this new fancy yet super simple way to make coffee. And that might not sound very interesting to you, but let me show you. Javi is a highly concentrated micro dose form of coffee made of 100% Arabica beans, and it's so convenient to use. It works for both hot or cold coffee, and you literally just take your water or milk or whatever beverage of choice, and then you add in one to two teaspoons of the Javi concentrate. I personally like to use two, maybe just a little bit more than two, and then you mix it up, and that's it. Of course, you can add in any type of creamer or sweetener or even whipped cream if you want, but that's it. It literally takes like less than a minute. 
so you don't have to fuss around with beans and grinds and coffee machines. It's so fast and convenient, especially for those days where I'm like just rushing out the door or on those like lazy days on the weekend, you know? And the best part is that I have a discount code for you guys if you wanna try Javi Coffee and get 15% off. The discount, of course, is Smartini XOXO, and you just have to enter it at checkout or you can shop through my link. In addition to just the plain coffee, they also have a whole bunch of other flavors and they come out with seasonal ones and honestly, they're just all so good. And there is also a decaf version, which is perfect for those days where I am craving iced coffee at like 8 p.m. So I will leave my discount code and my support link in the description box down below. Thank you so much for any support if you decide to try out this product. And of course, a huge shout out to Javi Coffee for sending me these products to share with you guys. Now, let's get back to the video. Next up is the Warm Up Crew in the color Bamboo Washed. So I got this one because I wanted to match my new green shorts. And I also had the purple one in my cart, but you guessed it. It got kicked out of my cart during the checkout glitches. And I really wanted that purple one because it was just so pretty. It was kind of like this lilac purple color. And I really wanted it because I love myself a cute matching like cropped sweater set. But at least I managed to snag the green one. It says Vitality on the front, which is actually what Balance Athletica is changing their name and their branding over to. So if I ever refer to something as Balance or Vitality, it's like the same thing. But this one is actually like really cute and comfy it is actually like more cropped than I thought it was gonna be I think I would like just a little bit more length on it but even though it's like quite cropped it's also still quite like oversized so there's a lot of like extra fabric like this way and this way the sleeves are baggy but I think this is like my perfect amount of baggy for an oversized crop the material is kind of like a terry cotton, but like a good quality one. And then this is just like a straight cut. So it's a raw hem, so it does roll up a little bit. So I definitely would like just a little bit of extra fabric in the length here. But overall, it's so cute, so comfy. I'm so upset that I didn't get the purple one, but maybe in the future I'll be able to snag some other colors. I also finally got a pair of the Ascend Rider shorts in the King Cheetah print. I have wanted these for a long time, but they always sell out. But they brought back the Kingdom collection a few times now, and they actually had these in stock during the sale, so I snatched them up. Now, this is not the same material as the Cloud Rider shorts material like it's not as soft and brushed but they are still comfy and there's no digging in on my legs they are also still a good length which I really really like I also have a lot of the ascend leggings and I also have some of the cloud leggings too so I really do like this material and the way that they fit on me but I am so happy to finally have these they're so pretty and I cannot freaking wait to go back to Disney World and wear these to Animal Kingdom so next up I have the affirmation pant it's like a sweat pant I have mine in the color acid rain and when they first came out I really wanted them I didn't get them and they sold out and I really regretted it and then they restocked and somehow still had them in stock for the sale so I snatched them up immediately I do already have this color in the cloud pant like the legging and they're just so pretty and I mean who doesn't love sweatpants they are so comfy and they sit at a good spot on my waist and they also have an adjustable drawstring they have pockets they have have the cute little affirmation here this pair says be the change which is super cute and they have other colors in these pants too and I think each one has a different saying on them so that's kind of cool now the only thing that I don't like is that the ankles have this little like velcro piece here which I think in theory is a good idea because you can loosen them up if you need to or tighten them up and it is really nice for my left leg because it is bigger so it's nice to be able to loosen it a little bit but the problem is if you do decide to loosen it, it kind of leaves a little bit of the rougher side of the Velcro exposed. So it has the potential to catch on things and snag them. So if you're sitting cross-legged on a carpet or a blanket or something, it can snag that or it can even catch on itself, like the sweatpants itself, and snag the sweatpants themselves, which I don't want to happen. Like, it took me so long to get a pair of these, I don't want to wreck them. So for that reason, I just leave mine tightened all the time and it is a little bit snug on my left leg, but overall it's still bearable. But it's definitely something I wanted to point out because it's just a little bit of a design flaw, I guess. I think the newer versions of the Affirmation Pant 
don't have the Velcro on them and instead it's just like the scrunched up part on the ankle. So that's good at least. Well, that is all I have for you guys today. Just a short and sweet little haul. Let me know in the comments down below which one of these items was your favorite or what you got from the sale. Once again, don't forget to check out my measurements in the description box. I find that those really help out a lot of people. While you're down there, give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you like these kinds of videos, and also check out my Javi Coffee link if you're interested in trying that out. As always, thank you so, so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Next video.